right, guys. This one's going to be doing a review for today. This one's going to be doing a review for uh, for you guys for today. This one is going to be doing a Christmas video. Of course, Merry Christmas to everyone. I want to make sure I uh, did a video and did, of course, our usual Christmas haul that we always like to do uh, every year where basically I sit here, chill with you guys, and, uh, you know, just kind of uh, hang out, really. So that's what this video is going to be. Make sure, of course, uh, if you um, are enjoying your holiday season and, you know, your Christmas, uh, leave a comment down below. Make sure to wish everybody else a Merry Christmas as well, too. And, um, yeah, let's just kind of chill and do our usual Christmas haul. So, if you guys have been following the channel for many years, you know I do this every year. I like to just kind of chill, do a video every year for Christmas, and uh, this will be the one for this year. So, uh, I did get a few things for Christmas as well, so we'll show that off as well, too, because you guys know I love my collectibles, so uh, we got a few things there as well. But, of course, I would love to specify as well before I get into it. Uh, Christmas is not about getting things. It's about spending time with your family, the ones you love, and uh, that is the important thing. So, you know, obviously make sure, of course, to spend uh, Christmas with the ones you love and the ones you uh, care about and all that stuff. That's what's important. And uh, that's the um, that's definitely one thing I wanted to uh, uh, specify. It's an amazing time of year. It's my favorite one of my favorite times of year, if not my favorite time of year. So anyway, um, let's show off a few of the things that we did get for uh, collectibles for this year. Uh, one of the big ones that I actually did get made for me is my channel logo uh, on like a on like a cup, which is pretty cool. This is like the updated Dan's Reviews logo. I hope there's not too much glare there. Uh, but uh, yeah, it's basically like a, you know, like a standard uh, black cup and you got the Dan's Reviews logo right there. So uh, that's the one from uh, this year uh, with like the neon uh, circle uh, logo for Dan's Reviews. So definitely gonna have these in some videos for sure. That's, uh, that's really amazing. And I really like that. Now, uh, I did get a few collectibles for this year. Um, one of the ones I did get that I was really happy about is I got a bobblehead Rick Grimes. Uh, you can see right here. I got Rick right here. And uh, yeah, there he is right there in his like murder coat. I believe this is like a season five Rick, although it also kind of looks like his 6B look because he doesn't have as long of a beard on this one. Um, and look at the face right there. That actually really looks good. Uh, I really like that. So there he is there. And actually, if you take a look at the bottom, you can actually see he has his uh, red machete right there in the dirt. So that's pretty cool. He's got his name at the front there. So there's Rick in his uh, murder coat. Really enjoy that. And then I did get a few ones for uh, Better Call Saul as well, too, because Better Call Saul also a uh, show that uh, wrapped up this year. So one of the ones I ended up getting was Gus. Uh, this is really, really cool. Uh, there he is right there in his Los Poyos uh, outfit. If you guys watch Better Call Saul, you'll know what this is. And uh, there's like the uh, the restaurant in the background there. You can kind of like see like the seating and stuff. So that's pretty cool. And you got Gus at the bottom there. So uh, they did him very well too. Uh, look at his face. That, uh, that looks pretty awesome. So I like that. And we also have um, a couple others here. We've got Mike, which looks pretty cool as well from Better Call Saul. Uh, you can see him there. He's got uh, like him, like you know, standing on the road and stuff. Uh, he's got like a newspaper uh, right there, and uh, he don't he don't look too impressed, do he? So that's pretty cool. Love Mike. Uh, probably one of my favorite characters of television, to be honest. Um, here we got the man himself, Better Call Saul uh, or Saul Goodman. So there he is, there in his like shiny suit, uh, one of his crazy suits that he wore throughout the series. And you've got at the bottom there, uh, world's best lawyer. So that is awesome. And you got his name down there and his uh, briefcase and stuff. So that's really cool. And then finally, last but not least, uh, you can't have Saul without Kim Wexler. So here we have Kim right here as well, too. Uh, here she is. And uh, yeah, this is pretty cool. This is obviously one of the other characters in the show. I got like their office uh, kind of in the background there. So that's pretty cool. And uh, there's Kim. So yeah, those uh, are really awesome. They come in like these really cool boxes. Uh, these are uh, made by Royal Bobble. So if you guys are interested, this is kind of what, like what the box look like. It'll have, uh, you know, the picture there. I'll have a picture of the character on the side and then another picture there and the character it is and uh, like a little message. I don't even know what the hell this is. Okay, so a little description of who Rick is. So that's pretty cool. So there's like the Rick one. And uh, I'll show you guys like one for Saul too. Like, there you go. There's the box for uh, the Saul one. Picture of him there. Little quote. And uh, of course, it's Saul. Uh, yeah, so pretty cool. Pretty awesome. Um, I was really happy to get those. Uh, those are really awesome. Now, I also did get this, which if any of you guys um, who don't remember back in the day, I think this was like probably like five years ago, something like this. Uh, there used to be a, um, well, there still is. Todd McFarlane still makes uh, like, you know, figures and stuff, but they stopped making Walking Dead about five years ago, unfortunately. But 
I always said back in the day, because I collect a lot of the five inch figures of The Walking Dead. Uh, if you guys have seen my room tour, you'll know that I have like a huge shelf full of like five inch Walking Dead figures and 10 inch and all that crazy stuff. So maybe I'll do an updated room tour for all y'all new people that haven't been here uh, for more than like, you know, a few months or something. Maybe I'll actually show you guys uh, the Dan's Review set because there's a lot of Walking Dead stuff in this room. Uh, this, this isn't it. Like, this is just a part of it. So, um, but yeah, anyway, you've got the Sheriff Rick Grimes from The Walking Dead Season 1. There he is there. You got, like, the walkie-talkie, uh, the baseball bat in here, which he um, killed his first walker with, you know, when he was training and stuff with Morgan. And he's got, like, his uh, cold python and stuff, and he's in a sheriff outfit, so... That's pretty freaking awesome, and uh, there's a set of a good few of these as well, too, which I actually do have the rest. I have uh, Gareth, Michonne, uh, Mudwalker, Herschel, Carl, uh, but I never got this one because this one was so freaking expensive. This one was like a um, good amount of money. This is like good like $70, $80, so I never got a chance to get it, but um, I finally, uh, finally got him for Christmas, and I was more than happy. This is an amazing uh, figure of Rick, and, you know, he's Sheriff Rick, so I want to get him because obviously Sheriff Rick is, you know... Very, very important to The Walking Dead. I, you know, I, it's one of his most iconic looks. So we got that right there as well too. And um, I, as you guys know, I love my Funko Pops, so I did get a few of these as well too. We got uh, Rhaenyra from House of the Dragon right here, and then we also have Alicent uh, from House of the Dragon here as well too. So that's awesome. Um, and I do have Damon as well too from House of the Dragon. So that's pretty cool. And um, we also have, which I definitely wanted to show. Because you guys know I love my Walking Dead calendars. Uh, there is the calendar for 2023 for The Walking Dead. And it's got a whole bunch of pictures from Season 11. I'll actually show that off right there. Uh, we got a lot of Season 11 stuff. Some 11A. Even some like 10C as well too here. But a lot of stuff from the final season there. So that's pretty cool. Uh, so there's that. So uh, I did get a few other things. But that's basically it for the you know collection side of things that I wanted to show you. Obviously, I wanted to wish you all a Merry Christmas, and uh, you know I hope that you're going to have an amazing day. I hope you guys all have a Merry Christmas out there, uh, Boxing Day, Christmas Eve, and Christmas today. So definitely, I'm um, very excited. we got a new year coming up. We are going to do our 2022 year in review once the year kind of uh, comes to an end, so expect that as well too. But uh, anyway, wanted to do this video for you guys. Wanted to wish you all a Merry Christmas, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. So if you're new to the channel and you enjoyed this video, make sure to click the subscribe button so you don't miss any other videos for The Walking Dead. And and, well, basically everything else. This video is packed with a whole bunch of stuff. So, anyway, and, of course, uh, follow me on Dan's The Walking Dead Reviews on Instagram, guys. And, of course, I'll see you guys really soon for more videos very soon. Enjoy the rest of your day, guys, and peace out. I've heard stories. Walkers that can climb walls and open doors. I was never sure if they were just stories.